Hey team, how you doing? Poetry for 2023. This week's poem comes off the back of me reading the Uluru Statement from the Heart. And um, it's uh, simply called Seen and Heard, but it's in support of all those people that um, that, that contributed to that statement from the heart and, um, and, and their plea um, for their voices to be heard. And so this poem is simply called Seen and Heard. And it goes like this. There's a yarn we need to have that concerns the greater good. The importance of a people having a voice that's understood. A people who were only seen a mere six decades ago. A fact that really blows my mind that this country was that slow. And yet we still are sitting upon our silent hands, disputing what we need to do to help a brother stand. It's the wishes of a people in a statement from the heart with desire of herd inclusion and a hope of a new start. How can we learn the lessons gleaned from 60,000 years? How can we heal the history of trauma, hurt and tears? Nobody cares how much you know until they know how much you care. And how can we say we've heard you when your voice we cannot hear? How can we say we're equal when statistics show we're not? We sadly lead the world in deficits. I think it's time to shift the plot. For if we always do what we've always done, we'll always get what we always got. If nothing changes and nothing changes, and yet we need that change a lot. Do we not all want our kids to shine with a future bright and new? How can we see that come to pass when we only do what we always do? How can we say we truly see if eyes are closed to we? Blinded by division, brought about by legacy. So can we come together and help a people have a voice with a self-determined future built from inclusion, hope and choice? Could one small act be all we need to turn this boat around? One single solitary word could give a silent voice a sound. So I say yes to the Uluru statement and your deep impassioned word. I back you up with all I got, with the hope you're seen and heard. Cheers team, have a great week.